Hey, what's going on, everybody? So uh, every year around this time in the past, of course, I've, I've always planned on opening something cool for my birthday. Admittedly, this year with all the stuff going on, I kind of forgot. Um, so this is going to air the day after my birthday, which is cool, but this is a happy birthday thank you box to myself. So I'm going to open a box of Commander Master Draft Boosters. Hopefully, hopefully, this does a lot better than, uh, than the recent set boxes have done for me. My, my luck on this set... At least on the set box, is kind of dried up. So let's give a draft box a shot, because I still love this set. It still has so many things that, can, that you're happy to get. So, let's get into this. Pack number one. We're not going to waste any time. We're going to have Fire Mines Vessel, Foil. Champion's Helm to start us off in the rares. I'm going to move this camera slightly. That's better. Stay. Dracuseth. Okay. Then you get the commons and uncommons. Starts with mutation in the borderless is cool. I'm going to have a uncommon pile because this set is absolute banging in uncommons. But that'll probably get filled up pretty quickly. So I'm going to try to do mostly borderless. Sapphire Medallion. Still cool. Even with the, the recent reprinting again, Braids. That was a really nice reprint in this set, though. And admittedly, I, I mean, putting it in MH3 means allows it to play, be played in Modern, right? So that's that that in itself is kind of cool. Storm Surge Kraken, the Crash. So I understand why they did it. Not that it needed a reprint already. But it made it Modern Legal. So that's kind of neat. And, you know, Ruby actually is getting played with. Campfire and Foil. That's a pet card of mine. Song of the Dryads. Glad to take that. I don't know what should I do here. I'll, I'll do something like that. Yuriko. Ghost Ramirez. Shirai. Hey, Lightning Greaves. My last three set boxes didn't even have a Lightning Greaves. Leave it to a draft box to actually give you the uncommons, right? Too bad draft boxes don't exist anymore. That was wild to me. Three set boxes in a row all did not have a lightning gears. Grand Abolisher. Once again, still a decent pull, even with the another reprint, this time in the big score. Curtain's Call. Sun Quan for first mythic. I don't know why I got excited about that. <laughs> Thren Dynamo. I do get more excited about that. Sky Shroud Claim. God, they just keep coming. Godama's Reach. Not going to pull it right now. I'll pull it later. Because that'll go into a separate pile. Okay. Okay. Sun Guan is not a hit. I don't know why I got excited there. That card fell a lot. More than I thought it would. Inspiring Statuary. Wrinkle. Master Prankle. I mean, we all knew it was going to fall, right? Because it was... It was in a set that nobody opened, so that there was very little made of in English. So it made sense. Evacuation. Kaikar. Okay. Now, the beautiful part of Commander Masters is you tend to hit, like, a bunch of things in a row, where there'll be, like, two packs that are just loaded. Personal Tutor. Your own personal tutor. Infernal Titan. Galta. Uh, you know what, these both are just going to kind of be the same pile. I'm just going to start them up now, which are like good rares that have value. Sapphire Medallion probably belongs with them at this point. But it's still a Sapphire Medallion. It still feels... It still feels nice. Akiri... Hey! That's it. There we go. Great Henge. That... That is exactly the kind of thing I'm hoping for. Exactly the kind of card I want, and a card I badly needed more of, a card I did not do well in pulling out of this product. Wake the Dead. Queen Marchesa. Awesome. In fact, this is going to sound weird, but that alone already makes this draft box better than my last three set boxes I opened for myself. It's wild. It's wild. Elvish Mystic and Foil Borderless. Hey, Deadly Rollick. You know what? Sorry, Sapphire Medallion. You've been downgraded. Wayward Swordtooth. Good card. I don't know if it held any value, actually, but I'm going to throw it over there with Galta. 
Valen. <laughs> That's funny. So when this set came out and so many of the singles were really cheap, I bought a couple great hinges, one in the uh, one in the foil etched, because God, it was down to like thirty dollars. I was like, no way, ain't no way, ain't no way, and I was correct to do so. Exsanguinate and foil, which is neat. Savine's reclamation, Krenko. I wonder if he's back up to three bucks like he always is. I don't know. I'm gonna look after the video. I haven't looked. Hey, Path to Exile. See, that's I've commented on this in the past when the set when I was opening like crazy. Like, one box of this, one box of Commander Master's Draft gives you so many staples. It's wild. Because then you could, like, place orders with companies and pay some shipping charges and or hope TCG Player Direct has it all in stock or, or pay a, a higher price point over at, uh, you know, Card Kingdom. Or, like, you get a box of this and you have a bunch of it. It's, it's, uh, the price points of this set was really high. Thrinax, Zakama. Yes, the, the price point of this set was high, but, like, just the sheer abundance of playable cards in Commander was something else. Like, cards that regularly go in decks. Of course, depending on your power level, right? Vindictive Lich, Bells and Lock, Bells and Lock, sorry, Bells and Lock, however you say that. <laughs> I, lo I love Assault Suit. <laughs> big, big fan of that. It's so fun. Slap that on a Titan. The whole table has fun. Kind of. <laughs> okay, foils a comma. Hey, spectator seating. Glad to see that. that that'll go up in the Deadly Rollick pile. So, Lortha. And a second Lightning Grease. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you, Fox. All right. We only have two Mythics so far, and we're almost at the end of the uh, second row. In my experience, these draft boxes tended to be six to seven Mythics. So... Interesting. Hammer of Nizan. I wonder, uh, wonder how that's recovering. Tesa. Not recovering. Nemata. Soul Ring again. Okay. All right, last pack in the middle. We're at two Mythics. One really good one and one that's a neat card, but obviously the price dropped on it pretty dramatically. Slime Foot. Grave Pact. Okay. Decent Mythic. Torrential Gear Hulk. Carador, which I'm glad got downgraded. I probably needed a second downgrade. But then it would be an uncommon. Could it be an uncommon? Wouldn't an uncommon. Was it Pauper EDH? So you can have an uncommon. Oh man. Yeah, so you can't downgrade it, can you? Because then Pauper EDH would get like a. would get Carador at Commander. Savage Beating. That, that is a Womp Womp. Mangara. It's okay. It's okay. It happens. Another Sky Shroud clean. It happens, right? Savage Beating for a while there went up to like a $50 card, and I'm sure Wizards was like, throw it in there! It's $50! Steel Shaper's Gift and Borderless. Kind of cool. Yannet. Tabrax. Okay. <clears throat> so we have six packs left. There should be another couple of Mythics. I'm hoping for one more banger. And I'm hoping for one more free commander spell that isn't named um, Obscuring Haze. Emerald Medallion. Okay. Taste of Karloff and the Borderless. Crazy to Spell War Stone. All right. I'm really happy about that hinge, though. That's important. Verdant Confluence. Hey, that's right. You were in this product. I totally forgot. Psych Rift. Awesome. I, I completely forgot that that was in this set. Oh, that's right, because they printed it in this, and then they printed it very shortly after in, uh, in a Ravnica Remastered, and yet the card is like still over $30 for a base copy. Okay, quick. Mythics, where are you? Yeah, yes! So Psych Rift into a deflecting slot. Awesome. So I can actually state right now, like, this box is pretty good. I'm pleased. Runescar Demon, which I think goes over there now. Gold Mane. Ooh, Ashnod's Altar. Those have been recovering nicely. Reliquary Tower. 
Okay, so three packs left and there should be two more mythics. So how are we gonna end this video? Shimmer Mirror. Boom Pile, that is not a hit. Uh, Nyx. Molomo. hmm. Hey, Borderless Exsanguinate. Hmm. Well, I got a Rollick, I got a Swat, I got a Tychonophric, I got some other cool rares, I got a Hinge, so if we're a little low on the Mythic count, all right. Let me be clear, I'm, I won't be ups will not be upset about that. I hope we're not, but, all right, Stonehoof Chieftain and Foil. Oh, okay, land, we got Rejuvenating Springs, I'll take that. Nekusar, who is an absolute monster. Yeah, we're gonna probably be short on the Mythics, hmm, okay. You know what? Great hedge. No, sorry. Grave. Yeah, great hedge. Grave pack. You got promoted. Okay. Last pack. Thank you all out there for watching, liking, commenting, subscribing, all that stuff that we do. I appreciate you all. Thank you for running through this with me. Hopefully, one more mythic for the road. Let's see. No. Rare. Heroic intervention. Okay. Good rare pull. Mythic? Nope. Ips mischief. Solid rare. Obviously, got another reprint, but. Mythic! Micaeus the Unhallowed. Okay. That's that's one of the mid-tier mythics. Alright, so we did get five at least. Four would have four would have been a little bit like what the heck just happened? Five is definitely within the, the scope of normal pull rates. So cool. Um nice box on the rares overall, especially the higher end rares. Uh, that was that was pretty sweet. Um Psych Rift showing up. That that I totally, totally forgot. Maybe that's because Rav Remastered came out, and I haven't been doing a lot of Commander Masters. Um, I don't know. I don't know why. <laughs> I've been asking myself the question: like, do more Commander Masters? But maybe it has something to do with Wizards release schedule, and I can only fit in so much stuff. Blah blah blah. Anyway, and I try to offer some things that are not super expensive for the patrons, anyway. And Commander Masters is always expensive. So. Either way, uh, I, I this, I'm I'm very pleased with this box. Happy birthday to me! Uh, this this is good. This is good. I I will take this. I got one banger mythic, and frankly, <laughs> I'm very happy to get one banger mythic. All right, see y'all. Bye.